Israel, for me, it's not just some political talking point. And I'm proud to say that I've served alongside the defenders of Israel, and I would absolutely do it again in a second. I think that anybody that's ever traveled through Israel understands that they represent everything that we could possibly want to see in a peaceful Middle East. They have a strong pro-U.S. military, and we don't have to go and fight their fights for them. They have a country of human rights for all people, regardless of their background. They have a free and democratic system where people know that they're only limited by their own drive. And I think most importantly, anybody that's been there knows that they're a land filled with people who love America and who love Americans. And right now, the world is being sold this lie that somehow the most peaceful country in the Middle East is preventing peace in the Middle East. But that is not the truth. It's not the truth to anybody that thinks about this for even a second. And as a member of Congress, I can tell you that I'm gonna fight against the BDS movement, the boycott, divest, and sanction movement that's out there that's so prevalent across many of our universities right now. I'm gonna to work to reinforce and expand the current memorandum of understanding between our two great nations. I think it's one of the most important things that exists out there. And I can tell you that as somebody who's already worked to defend Israel while volunteering alongside of their military, I'm gonna to work to continue to defend her by working to expand training between our two countries. I think it's one of the best things that ex that's existed between our two countries and make sure that we continue to support programs that ensure that Israel can defend against the threats that they face. The barrage of rocket attacks that we've seen there year after year, the threats of, uh, of people tunneling into Israel, and probably most importantly, to work that, to make sure that Israel and the United States continue to work together to ensure that Iran has no pathway whatsoever to developing a nuclear weapon or the missile technology that's needed to deliver one to either of our countries. I'm Brian Mast, and I approve this message. Please visit our website, mastforcongress.com.